Hey, it's Nathan with CrazyMarketing.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up automations in Active Campaign that are triggered by dates. So, like a birthday. So, every time somebody's birthday comes around, Active Campaign can automatically send them an email wishing them happy birthday, giving them a discount code, you know, something like that. So, anyway, there's a couple ways you can go about doing it. So, if you came into campaigns here and you created a brand new campaign, you see the option for a date based campaign which could send on a contact's birthday anniversaries and more so this is one way you could go about setting up a campaign in order to send emails based off of a certain date however what I prefer to do is do it inside of an automation because I like to have all my automated stuff in the automation section within active campaign so that way I'm, I can keep everything organized so I'm gonna be building an automation in this video now before we actually get started we need to go ahead and set up a field that has a date in it so that way we can base the trigger of the automation on that date so let's go ahead and come to contacts and we'll go to fields right here. And I'm gonna go ahead and add a birthday field under the personal information area. So I'm gonna come up here to add field and we'll call this one birthday. And I'll put it in the correct group, which is personal information. Now I have another video all about fields. So if you need help with fields, check out my channel. And we wanna make sure that this is a date field right here. So we'll do date and then we'll go ahead and click on add. So there we go. We now have a contact field that represents the birth date of our subscribers. And now we can go ahead and set up an automation that's triggered by this particular field. So let's come to automations now. And we're gonna go ahead and create an automation and we'll go ahead and start from scratch and continue. And we're gonna look for date based. So we have date based right here. We'll click this option. All right, so we're gonna do starts one day on, and then we're gonna look at the contact fields, and then we have birthday right here. But as you can see, there's also a subscription date and creation date field. So there's a couple of fields that are already native to Active Campaign that you could also select. But I have birthday right here, so we'll select that option. And then when do we wanna check for the birthday? So probably daily. And then you wanna do it probably, you know, sometime in the morning when you know when they're waking up, checking their email, stuff like that. So I'll do 9 a.m. and then you can do contacts time zone or your particular time zone. So I'll do contacts time zone. So if they're on the West Coast, they get the email at 9 a.m. their time instead of 9 a.m. my time, which would be 6 a.m. their time, which might be too early. Maybe they're sleeping in on their birthday, you know, whatever it is. And then we have runs. So when month and day matches conditions and it gives us examples. So birthdays, which is what we're doing here or annual contracts and other days that recur yearly. And then we also have when and year, month and day matches conditions. So this would be on a specific day, for example, like an event or a contract expiration and so on. So if you have a specific date in the future that you want something to expire on, then you would go ahead and select this option. But for something that's recurring, we'll go ahead and do this option right here. And then we're not gonna segment the contacts entering this automation. So we'll go ahead and click on add start. And then we can go ahead and send them their email. So we'll click on send email. And so I call it happy birthday email one. And then I could go ahead and design my template. I have another video on email design. So check out my channel if you need help with that. I'm gonna go ahead and click on save and design later. And then I'll come up here and rename my automation to happy birthday and save. And let's go ahead and click on the trigger again real quick. So you can see that it kind of changed the naming of my trigger. So it says starts on the birthday, daily, 9 a.m., context time zone, and so on. So it's gonna trigger right on their birthday, 9 a.m., save start, and it'll automatically send them and wish them a happy birthday. Just make sure that you turn this automation active before you go ahead and head out of here. Otherwise, it's not gonna send any emails out. And so that's pretty much it on creating automations that are triggered by a date. It's a pretty simple concept and hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, I appreciate it. So like, comment, subscribe, and or check out crazyoutmarketing.com and I hope you have a great rest of the day.